Hello dear my friends, welcome to AW Fashion Style TV. I am Abdul Wahab and reporting for you. This video is very much important and related to the earlier video. The video that has been named as the Read Petition Against Holy Quran in India by one Washim Rizvi from Lucknow, UP, India, Uttar Pradesh. So, what I want to say uh, that this thing is not uh, new in this world, but what is their objection? What are those 26 ayats? Actually, I came down to the earth and asked many practicing Muslims if they do know about actual the ayats or verses that has been uh, uh, put in uh, in objection by Wasim Rizvi but nobody can tell me I went to search Google either but no newspaper magazines or no portals of news has ever said that what are those ayats has been actually put in controversially put in uh, uh, allegation put in objection that they should be abrogated but no one knows about this but you know my dear friend actually this is not new earlier the Hindu Mahasabha also went to the High Court of Calcutta and put those ayats in courts alleged as um, objectionable to many people so I am uh, and in that sense and in that uh, uh, case related with it one man has already written a uh, mini book a booklet um, answering all those allegations then I shot on Google and find according to my knowledge that uh, this is not new and this cannot be only done by this Indian people throughout the world so many people have raised questions about this uh, I asked, they thought that these are objects or what are they? I am going to search, I am going to search and have gone already on uh, Google and find out the, what Europeans and Americans actually, the English uh, speaking people have that objections regarding those ayahs. You know in generally I find that in Google and one by one I am going to tell the first ayat actually they put forward an objectionable is that from the Surah Tawa and it is 33. It is 33, ayat number 33. What is that? It is, what is that it is? It is saying from this book written by uh, Abdel Halim, Oxford publication and the writer is Abdel Halim, he is from Egypt by birth, he is an Arabian speaking person and uh, he teaches uh, Arabic and Hadith and Quran Islam in the Oxford University Department. So he says he translates it like that, it is he who has sent his messenger with guidance and the religions of truth to show that it is above all other religions. However much the idolaters may hate this. Do you understand? You will get the clipping, you know, a screenshot of those things. But this is merely, <coughs> merely, yeah, just checking brains and tolerance of the Muslim people. You know, by comparison, I can, <coughs> I can take as an example that in Europe, especially uh, in France and in Netherlands, in Germany, in Sweden, Norway, they actually what they do, actually they are trying to uh, forbid, trying to, trying to, trying to just create an obstruction when they say Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allah is the great. These things pinches them, but I do not know why. And Muslims cannot answer properly. Allahu Akbar, Allah is the greatest. 
Allah who Akbar, Allah is the greatest. If I say Allah is the greatest, why is the harm I'm going to do with the other people? At the same time, if I say my religion with <coughs> his guidance and prophet and with his guidance, prophet and Allah's guidance, if it has been given in this world and over all the other religions, so what is harm to you? Well, no, no, man, you cannot say like that. You cannot say this is the best religion in this world. Islam is the best religion in Islam. Islam is the best religion in this world. And Allah who Akbar, Allah is the greatest. You cannot say this. My question is then, who is the greatest? You know, actually, here is the logic. Who is the greatest? Your God, you say, your God is the greatest, but you have not. You have not and you have not. You fail to do that. Then who is the greatest? Man is the greatest? Never. Nature is the greatest? Never. So, the greatest, the position was, was anti, you know, man and Muslim came, Islam came, God, Allah, sent his prophet with guidance and he said, Allah, is the greatest because the position was empty and the position was also empty that what is the greatest what is the greatest religions in this world what is the best religions in the world this position was also backed by uh, by many people by by the people of this world individuals of this world so islam came and fulfilled fill the gap fill the empty position so sure, Islam is the greatest and Islam is the greatest and Muslims are the greatest and Allah who Akbar, Allah is the greatest. Here if I say, he is the best man in this country. So it does not mean that everybody is subjugated to him, everybody is subordinated to him, subjugated to him or I never call anybody bad names. Well, what is stupid logic people are trying to say? Isn't it stupid? Yeah, it is stupid. Stupid is full of stupidity. So, Tawbah, verse 9, says in another, in another book uh, from Lakhno, written by Abdul Majid, he, he translated it like that. He, it is who has sent down his messenger with guidance and the truth, true faith and the true faith that he may make it prevail over all religions although the associators may detest this is the ayat this is the ayat toba shura toba verses 33 they object they object the people object but their objection is not correct because even if i say i'm the best person in the world you have to tolerate it tolerate in the sense it does not torture you and you have to tolerate it is my opinion and i am free to do i am free to do express my opinion my thought my ideas i shall never hurt anybody when i say i'm the best or allah Allah who Akbar, Allah is the greatest. You know, do you understand? Allah is the greatest because the greatest position, the greatness of the position, the great position, the topmost position was empty because nobody claimed that earlier. And what is the greatest religion? It was also vacant, empty. Nobody earlier at the time claimed if it, do not claim it and you keep the position back and then it is my right or our right or the right of anybody to fill the gap, fill the empty space, fill the back end positions. Do you understand my point? Do you understand my logic? Thank you very much. I am Abdullah and you are watching AW Versatile TV and I like you to like my videos, share my videos and below the videos please comment whether do you like or not thank you very much